Okay, it's the official, unofficial, official first day of con. Yeah, would you say? Yep. So I'm getting ready to put on my first outfit of the day. Babe is already dressed. Um, he's going to run downstairs and get me some bobby pins because I forgot to bring extra. Something. And some scissors. Don't make fun of me! <laughs> he likes to make fun of me. But yeah, I'm just doing my makeup while he runs to the CVS. Luckily, we have a CVS in this hotel. And he's going to get me some bobby pins, some scissors. Did I actually get anything else? I don't remember. I don't no. think I did. Just that? Bobby pins, scissors. Okay. So yeah, I'm just like trying to like fix this wig cap because it's like giving me issues. But I'm also like trying to like not. Okay, there we go. Alrighty, so I am going to finish my makeup and then come back when we are leaving the hotel. All right, see you guys in a minute. Bye. All right, now we are outside walking to Kobo. To go to the dealer. <laughs> what? <laughs> Some rain just dropped on me. <laughs> like a huge raindrop just dropped on me. Issues. What was I saying? Right. We're going to Kobo to go to the dealer's room and to check out some panels that are over there. I am dressed in my Slytherin girl attire. This time I have on a cardigan and a new skirt that has pockets. I love a skirt with pockets. I love a dress with pockets. I love anything with pockets. They need to start making dresses and skirts with pockets. Us girly girls like pockets. Now we're in the dealer's room. Hi, what do you mean? I'm these lights are like throwing my vision off so much right now. And I'm getting ready to look at my favorite booth in just a moment. Sorbet Jungle. I love their plushies. And then this booth, I forget what it's called, but they make like all sorts of like steampunk stuff. So you guys see, so like, they make all sorts of steampunk stuff. It's really nice. Shall we continue? Huh? It says, shall we continue? Of you explaining Halo to me? Dre is explaining Halo to me, like he's going like all the way back. I'm, I'm sort of keeping up, understanding as much as I can understand. Alright, see you guys later. So we came back to our room. I switched my glasses out because those other glasses were killing me and I walked around for half of my time in the dealings, dealer's room not being able to see a thing because my glasses were so fogged up and like cloudy. We had to rush back to the hotel room because Mr. Dre left his phone in the room and almost had a heart attack because he couldn't find it. And I told him it was in the room. Yes, I'm going to give you shit about this for a little while. So, by the way, she's over here dying because she didn't have any of her meds that she knew her allergies would be triggered by. So she's running back and forth to the bathroom almost every five minutes just to grab some tissue. By the way, I only went to the bathroom twice. Once to clean my glasses and second to blow to my nose. Big old wide so of So that tissue. whole five minutes that thing is an over-exaggeration. She's been blowing her nose non Secondly, since we've been out. I told Mr. Dre to pack a weekend's worth of gummies so that we wouldn't have this problem. Because her immunity system but is like no, crap. she forgot it. Just like she forgot some stuff. Just like I forgot some stuff. Shame. It's just that Shame. she want to have a weak immunity. Shame. She's the one over here needing all the extraness. I packed extra meds. All I needed was gummies. Which he was supposed to pack. I mean, these meds are supposed to help you. Shame. I wouldn't need the meds if you packed the gummies.
So you're saying you packed the meds just because you knew I wouldn't pack the gummies. No, it's because I packed the meds because whenever I go away somewhere, I always pack meds because of my jacked up immune system. That sounds like a you problem, not a me problem. Man, you know, it's more like an us problem because you were supposed to pack the gummies. A- am I wrong? Am I wrong? Like, cause I, I, I took the initiative to pack my meds like I always do, but he was supposed to pack the gummies because I said the night before, hey, pack a weekend's worth of gummies, especially and vitamin C. I also C. told you, hey, double back through your bag and pack the night before to make sure you got everything in there. And I see we both end up messed up. Well, the only thing I left was some socks and a fan. And the only thing I left was a shirt and the gummies. So if I die, it's your fault. I mean, if you can't sleep, it's your fault, too. He's got a point. (laughs) But if I die, what are you going to tell my viewers, Dre? Mm, Huh? I don't know what to tell y'all. So, if I die... She just had a weak immunity. There was nothing I I could do about it. This is the person you need to come and talk to. This guy, right here. I'll tell y'all the whole story. Yep. He's also going to have to answer to my mom. I'll let her know too. And my mom, all five foot, two and a half of her, is going to kick your ass. I'll let your mama know, just like I let you know, it ain't my fault. Your genes is weak and y'all got a weak immunity. I am sorry that I am such a sick person all the time. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Let's, let's, let's do a backstory. Quick little backstory. I have really bad allergies that can affect me any time of the year, literally any time of of the year it doesn't matter spring summer fall winter if my allergies want to act up they will act up and i will suffer Mm -hmm. greatly for it very much but i wouldn't be suffering if dre bought the guy while he's getting naked i mean it is a cvs downstairs so she go ahead and get some gummies so so we're just gonna have extra gummies when we go home Ain't nothing wrong with having extra gummies. True. Nothing wrong with having extra, you know, vitamin gummies. You like vitamin gummies. You're a vitamin gummy. Household? Family? (laughs) I have a very difficult time taking any kind of pills. Like, no matter what kind of pills or if I try and mix it up in my food or whatever, my throat somehow has like a sixth sense of like, no, you didn't chew anything or you didn't chew everything fully. So, no, it ain't going down. And I'm talking about I can mix it through just about anything. Majority of the time, I got to take the capsules apart, mix the powder in a drink or food just to digest what's important. And as we all know, that's not the proper way to ingest. the. He got to make lean, y'all. I got to make lean. I'm done. (laughs) I got to make lean. Apparently, (laughs) I'm future over here. (laughs) Um, I'm future. (laughs) Apparently, this one just think that she's with a trap. A trap dealer, a drug dealer. I'm a trap queen. She's a trap queen. Oh, my God. What? Why did you not tell me that that mask had all this stuff on my face? Well, you Oh, my God. Yeah, like, well, it's all around my face, around the lining of it. Jeez. It's okay. I have moisturizer. I got to scrub the hell out my face. Mm-hmm. Yup. Yup. Exfoliate. Exfoliate mm-hmm. your skin. I exfoliated today. Well, we are going to sit here for a minute because our feet are dead. And then we're going to go down to the food court and get some yummy, good food so I can take medicine so I won't die tonight. Yup. Yay! Medication.
This is the Greek Town Station. Hey guys, I wouldn't say I'm not gonna say good morning because it's not morning, it's actually one o'clock in the afternoon. I've been up for a little bit, just been chilling in a room, just cleaning up a little bit. That's stuff on my screen. Anyway, I am about to shower and get dressed, get ready for the day. <clears throat> the panels that I'm going to, they don't start till six, but I am going to like roam around. I'm not just going to like stay here cooped up till six o'clock. I'm going to roam around and whatnot. Let me show you guys a little OOTD action of what I'm going to have on. I don't know if you can see it, but there's the OOTD of the day. I'm going to be wearing Rima today from Vampire Night. Got the whole thing laid out. So yeah, make sure to take pictures of myself with the cosplay. I didn't really take pictures with Slytherin Girl. Because all I added to my outfit was a cardigan, which was so comfortable, by the way. Cardigan is life. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and shower, get dressed, do makeup, and all that jazz. I will see y'all in a little bit. Bye-bye!